What is a file request? How do you make one? And what should you do if you get one? What's going on everyone? My name is Matthew and welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, we will be going over file requests in Dropbox and everything pertaining to them. Let's dive in. All right, so here we are on Dropbox, where we'll focus first on creating the request. In order to set it up, you need to have a Dropbox account, so be sure to have that set up beforehand. Now, set up a folder for the media, like I have in this example. Over here to the right, click on the three dots. In the drop-down menu, scroll down to Activity and Request Files. Now, you'll have a new box come up with different controls within the file request. Go ahead and give it a title. I'll call it footage for video. You can also give it an optional description, but as the parentheses would suggest, it's not completely necessary. But it can help the receiver of the request to better understand what they've received. I'm giving it a brief description here. Now, you can select the requests folder which I'll keep as is since I set that up beforehand. But good to have the option should you change your mind. You can also add more info below if you have a pro account, but we'll skip this and click on create. Now comes the sharing of the request. You can copy and share a link that Dropbox created or send via email above, which is what I'll do in this example. I'll go ahead and send that to myself. Click on share, and now it's on the way. Here, you'll see your active file requests. If I click on the request I just created, I can adjust a couple of things and even close the request here on the bottom left. But for now, we'll leave this be. Now at this point, we'll shift over to what you as the receiver of the file request should do. Open up the email you received and click on upload files. A new tab will open where you have the option to drag your media into the tab or manually add. For this scenario, we'll go ahead and do it manually, so go on and click Add Files. In the drop-down menu, click Files from Computer. I'll go ahead and select two files, in this case some footage I shot in the Zuma Ridge in Malibu. After selecting the media, you should see them listed here. Now we'll click Upload and you'll see everything loading into Dropbox one at a time. And you're all set. Now let's briefly go back to the creator's view. I'll click on the request and below you'll see the two videos I uploaded. The file request is a success. Now you can do what you will with what's been received. And that's how you do it guys. Um, now there is one additional tip that I will share. Um, sometimes with Dropbox, it can't really handle so much media at once. So it's definitely important that you upload small chunks at a time, um, especially if your internet connection is weaker than most. Um, Dropbox will have a little bit of trouble uploading so much footage at once. So definitely try to do it small chunks at a time if you're having trouble um, uploading everything that you want to upload. And then if you do it in small chunks, you should be all set to go. If you guys enjoy this video, please hit that like button below, hit the subscribe button, and click on the bell so that every time I upload a new video, you get notified. Thanks so much everyone for watching. I'll catch you guys next time.